Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Dockerty Dozen. And I am here for my weekly grocery shop for our family of 14, and I thought I'd take you along. That is not my baby crying, someone else's. I come kid free. This is my me time. This is my self care. Let's go. Part one. I have our grocery list separated out by areas of the store based on our meal plan that we made together as a family. Deshaun helped me make the dinner menu this week. I'm still learning what he likes to eat. And he requested beef and bean burritos, so I'll be making those on Tuesday. I ran out of the twins' queso last week, so I'm gonna get three of those this week. Get some more juice. Capri Sun. Last one. Sunny D. I don't know why, but we're going through an insane amount of drinks lately. And more Gatorade. James is still having some major food aversion, so I'm gonna get him his trail mix that he really likes. And I'm gonna get two bags of that, just in case any of the kids sneak into it. Off to get James's goldfish. He's been eating a lot of these. Patrick requested confetti muffin bites, so I'm gonna get a few boxes of those for him. Can't forget Bree's chocolate chip muffin bites too. Nevea requested pirate's booty. If you have never tried this stuff, it's so good, you gotta try it. And now to grab the chips for their lunches and school snacks every day. I'll get some smart food. The Cheetos packs. Patrick's animal crackers. And this is the perfect Doherty trifecta box of cookies. Oh my gosh. Bodhi loves Chips Ahoy and mini Oreos, and Brie loves the Nutter Butter ones. We go through a jar of jelly a week. I personally like grape jelly the best, but my kids like strawberry better. Peanut butter. We also go through a jar of mayonnaise a week. We are stocked up on ranch dressing, but we are out of Italian salad dressing. So I'm gonna grab two bottles of that. And James's tuna fish. He did not like the other kind I got, so I'm gonna go back to the regular kind. Ketchup for the week. And olives for the week. I'll grab some pickles for the charcuterie board one day this week. And that cart is full. I'm going to leave that up front, grab my grocery list, and go grab another cart. Cart two. I gotta get Bree's cereal. When Patrick and Bree moved in from the residential treatment facility, the only thing they would eat was cereal. I swear that was all they ate at residential. And so we've kind of broken them of that habit, but they do have their moments where they still want cereal for that security purpose, um, since that's what they ate for so many years. So I will say their diet has greatly improved from what it was three years ago. But yes, um, they do have quite a love for cereal. I am going to do an oatmeal bar this week. It's a super fun thing. That's really easy. My kids love it. And 
and we need some syrup because Bodhi still thinks he needs to pour the entire bottle on one tiny little pancake. I am out of canola oil. And I'm gonna get some snack packs. The kids have been liking these. 12 to a box. <laughs> so that's one snack. So two boxes. I'm gonna get these for pot pies this week. And I'm almost out of my Costco bag of sugar. So I'm gonna grab this until I can get the Costco next. I'm going for the big bag of chocolate chips this week because the babies broke into my chocolate chip stash last week. And some flour until I can get to Costco again. Gotta get the pumpkin for pumpkin chocolate chip bread. We also need more cooking spray. Josh likes the olive oil one the best. Can't forget the coffee. And more coffee. We're almost out of applesauce pouches. Half of my kids love these cinnamon applesauce pouches. We are out of Nana's homemade applesauce. So I'm gonna get Wegmans brand until she makes us some more. Deshaun has been eating the twins fruit snacks, which is awesome. I love finding foods that my kiddos will eat. So I'm gonna get two boxes of fruit snacks this week. I was wondering why we were going through them so fast. I'm making chicken pot pies this week and this is the secret ingredient, better than bullion, the chicken, roasted chicken base. I'm telling you, this stuff is amazing. You don't even need to put salt in them. It's amazing. I'm gonna get Deshaun more of his kind bars. Um, I only see minis, so maybe that's all they make. He likes the caramel ones. And I am out of my Nature Valley bars that I eat for breakfast. I did not like that other kind I tried the other week. Not good. Back to Nature Valley. I need the vegetables for my pot pies. It's the easiest recipe ever and my kids love it. You just need canned carrots, canned peas, canned corn, make a simple roux, add your bouillon base. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I need more rice for the beef and bean burritos. And we're almost out of popcorn. Gotta get movie theater. We've been going through a lot of Tostitos. I'm gonna grab these lime ones. They're mine and Jason's favorite. And I'm gonna get three bags of the regular Tostitos for the week. Plus the Doritos, nacho cheese, cool ranch, and the spicy one. Grab some pretzels. And my kids love these Cheetos puffs. They can eat an entire bag of this together. And I'm gonna grab myself the Salsa Verde chips. These things are amazing. That cart is full. I'm gonna leave it up front, get another cart. It's about 1.15. I just realized I haven't had lunch, so I'm gonna get a wrap and another one for tomorrow's lunch and some soup.
grab a spoon and eat this on the way when I pick up Deshaun and Nevea after grocery shopping. I gotta get the rotisserie chickens for pot pies. I like the plain kind. And shrimp for shish kebabs this weekend. Now with 14 people in our family instead of 12, I've been making all six pounds of the family pack of ground beef for one meal. So I'm actually going to need three packs of ground beef and I need steak for the shish kebabs. I'm gonna get three flank steaks for that. Sausage for grill night. Dashes bacon. And I'm gonna get some hams for breakfast one day this week. I feel like I need two hams. I don't think one will be enough. Deli meat for the week. We will go through one thing of ham and one thing of turkey. pepperoni for the charcuterie boards and for my pepperoni pizza pasta casserole on Friday. Fajitas for the beef and bean burritos. We are out of string cheese. And gotta get my 10 pounds of shredded cheese for the week. Five pounds of mozzarella, five pounds of cheddar. Get some bricks of cheese for our daily charcuterie boards. Most of my kids like the Colby Jack and the sharp, not extra sharp, just sharp. I don't know what the difference is. And I like Swiss cheese, so once in a while I'll grab Swiss. We need more butter. Kids love these Wegmans mashed potatoes. And I'm going to get some cinnamon rolls. Okay, way down there. I get three things of those for one breakfast and a crescent rolls. I still have some of Alex's peach yogurts, so I just need the Yo Crunch yogurts and the fruit yogurts. Sour cream for the week. Ricotta for the pizza casserole. And I usually get four days worth of bread at a time. Hawaiian rolls. Last week's bagels went bad really fast. So I'm gonna check the dates on all of this week's bagels just to be safe. Okay, May 18th. That's good. It gives us a week. Hot dog buns for grill night. And the bread for the week. I'm gonna get some allergy medicine and head up front to leave this with the other two carts. Cart four. I'm gonna get a watermelon. And here's my weekly inspection of strawberries. These actually look really good. Two for two. Blueberries. 
James was just asking for corn on the cob, and I told him it was going to be too early for that. He's going to be really excited that they have it in stock. You can buy it pre-shucked, but there's no fun in that. Like, we love shucking the corn. My kids, like, fight over it. Twenty-four ears of corn. Gotta get salt potatoes to go with it. These green grapes are not looking very good today. Yeah, that's a no. I'm gonna pass on the green grapes. Let's see how the red grapes look. These look pretty good. I'll go with a bag of red grapes for the week. We are all out of peppers, so I'm going to get two packages, family packs of peppers. Grape tomatoes. And I'm going to get a bag of blood oranges and heirloom oranges. Let's see how the apples look this week. These are not looking very good. Okay, these ones look good. Empire. I like Empire. That's actually my favorite kind. So we'll get a bag of Empire apples. And bananas. People always ask me why I buy green bananas, but just feel like they last longer. If I buy yellow bananas, they're brown tomorrow. If I buy green bananas, they're yellow tomorrow. mushrooms for the shish kebabs but actually I think I'm gonna wait and get those on my midweek restock so they don't go bad before then I'm going to get avocado for our beef and bean burrito bar on Tuesday Sometimes I pick leftovers for the kids' lunches if I make a big meal, and our leftover containers have dwindled to basically none. They disappear. So I'm gonna get another pack of these snap packs. Bottled water for the week. And I do need to get eggs this week because New York dropped to some frost temperatures at night. My chickens got mad and stopped laying a dozen eggs a day. Weekly White Claw. Out of all random things to request, Zoe has requested Uncrustables. So I'm gonna get both kinds. I don't know which ones she wants. And gotta get Zoe her mop sticks. I make fruit smoothies every week with these frozen berries. I 
my kids are really into Klondike bars right now, so I'm going to stock up on those. Yesterday, Bodie was saying he wanted red ice cream, and I had no idea what he meant, but now I know what he means. He wants the lactose-free ice cream from Wegmans in the red container. So I'm going to get vanilla and mint chocolate chip. It looks like they're out of the big bags of ravioli, so I'm gonna wait and get that at Costco this week. We need more cups. and they are out of the big jars of marinara that I like so I'm going to get that when I go to Costco and I'll just get the pasta there when I go there I love this store there are four people helping to check me out and then they bring my carts out the side door so I can drive over and pick them up Yay, people to help me. Not much trunk space. So we're gonna have to just shove them in the seats, All I right, guess. Yeah. Thank Enjoy you so much. Time. Yeah. That was perfect. It's two o'clock. I have to be at pickup for Nevaeh and Deshaun at 2.15. It's gonna take me right about 15 minutes to get there. Um, so, oh my gosh, that worked out perfectly. I think I'm gonna switch and do my, ma my weekly main haul grocery haul on Mondays now because it feels like the store's not as crowded the store is like more prepared for a large order they're not overwhelmed you know on weekends it gets really busy uh, that worked out perfectly midday on Monday my mom comes every Monday to watch Harley or to spend time with her she takes her someplace every Monday so yeah Mondays will be my new big grocery haul. So I'll do Mondays for the big one, Thursdays for the mini haul. That's what I did last week. It worked out well. So now I'm going to eat my lunch. Yes, at two o'clock in the afternoon. On my way to pick up Nevea and Deshaun and get home perfectly timed so all the kids can help unload groceries. Here's the receipt for people who like to see it. Someone always ends up screenshotting it and loading it into their fetch rewards before me. <laughs> I even made it with five minutes to spare. I was like sweating, <laughs> loading those groceries in with them. I don't know why I wore a sweatshirt today. It's 70 degrees. Anyways, there we go. I am gonna wait for the kids and like enjoy two minutes of my own brain time. <laughs> it's rare, but it happens. <laughs> Thanks for joining me on my shopping haul today for my family of 14. You are strong, you're beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I'm so proud of you. I'll see you tomorrow.